Uh, for Detroit, which obviously has had some serious problems in bankruptcy, it's a $555 million investment in the area. So that's big for Michigan, but it's also big for the U.S. You know, the Ford Fusion, which is the, the car that's being added to this line, has been previously produced in Mexico, mainly produced down in uh, Nogales. Now it's going to be brought here. They're going to make over 100,000 of those here a year. So for the U.S. economy, that's key. It adds 1,400 jobs. Now for Ford, it's very important because the company is going to be better able to meet demand. Ford Fusion sales have only risen 13 percent year to date. Now the reason is because they just can't make enough for customers to buy. The demand is there. They think they can sell a lot more of these cars and they'll get out there and do that by boosting production here. It also helps to change uh, the picture with competition a little bit. So right now the Camry is the best selling midsize sedan in the U.S. It has been for the last 11 years. They sell about 240,000 Camrys a year. Ford sells 180,000 of these fusions and it hopes it'll be able to boost that number and get past maybe even the second place Honda Accord and start giving Camry a real challenge. So it's key for the local economy, it's key for the U.S. economy, and it's really key for Ford to get out there and be able to produce uh, these cars, interestingly enough, on the same line as they now produce the Mustang, and they could add even more production here if need be.